Hello everyone. Welcome to another episode of Real Talk 381. My name is Lashern, and today's topic of discussion is trusting in God. Just so you know, by definition, trust is a firm belief in the reliability, truth, ability, or strength of someone or something, or a hope or expectation. Man. What we're going to do today is we're going to focus on a verse that exemplifies trusting in God and the reason behind it. And then we're also going to have a little explanation about that. And then to follow it up, we're going to wrap it up with a little poem that I wrote, which is also a prayer. Stay tuned. All right. Today's verse is going to be from Proverbs chapter 3, verses 5 and 6. Trust in the Lord with all your heart and do not lean on your own understanding. In all your ways submit to him and he will make your path straight. Man. So what that's saying right there is just as it comes out. Trust in the Lord with all your heart in every situation and everything that you're going through. Whether it's the bills being needing to be paid, something's happening in your life that you you can't deal with a death in the family oh man anything that will bring pain to you that will leave you broken down trust in God because he is there with you and he will never leave you trust in him in all your ways submit to him whether you're dealing with greed Hip hypocrisy, narcissism, anger. Man, that right there speaks right here to me. Because there are times whenever I say that I'm patient, but then I get tested to show that I am not patient. He's saying trust in him and he'll give you that patience. He'll make all your ways straight. He'll show you that love that you need. Oh man, this brings me to my poem. It's called Prominent Love Author. Dear Father, or the Prominent Love Author, time taken tribulations taught through missed orders has guided my thoughts through limitless borders. And yet I stand shaken when I heard your last order. Success and happiness without a child to father destined to teach love to those with disorders i find trust in no man no father no brother so i clouded my mind please find me another i strayed from my path the one that you set i lifted my feet closed my eyes and slept lost focus and yet you carried me along I'm sorry, I wept, but you gave me a song, a dream, a vision, the hope and the drive. You brought me to death's door to show me my life, my faults and misfortunes, pain, stress and strife. My duties ignored, rushed through, pushed aside. I still don't know why you keep me alive. Despite my failures, narcissism, and pride, I am not worthy of the altar for sacrifice. My heart and mind tainted a maximum price. For my spirit and soul, you call at night and speak through my dreams to give me foresight. Forgive me, my father, for my doubt and dismay. Continue to guide me each and every day. All right, wherever you are, I want you to take a deep breath. And exhale. Now close your eyes. Lord, I thank you for every gift, for every blessing, 
for every person that you have placed in our paths. I thank you for every listener and I thank you for opening my ears so that way I can listen to you. Lord, I ask you to open our eyes so that way we can see the path that you have chosen for us and that you have set for us. Open our hearts so that we, so that way we can love and trust in you in all of our ways, in all of our heart and minds. Help us to submit to you in all of our ways. Help us to let go of the things that hold us down. Help us to let go of our past. We thank you in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. Thank you for listening. Please like, subscribe, comment, share with a friend, family, and I'll see you in the next video. You have a great day.